EFC Africa presents Africa's Greatest Warriors, Costa Ianu versus Don Madge. Costa Ianu, the most dominant champion in EFC Africa history. Costa Ianu is the best pound for pound fighter on the continent. Big knee, the Gin Costa gets the choke in. Costa Ianu is undefeated and untouched in six bouts. The undefeated, undisputed EFC Africa lightweight champion, Costa Ianu, has annihilated every single one of the opponents placed in front of him. Backed by his massive Greek following, Ianu has dominated the hexagon for over three years. Costa probably had one of the most memorable EFC Africa debuts. He came out of nowhere, not a lot of people knew who he was, but his fan base came in their drones to support him at EFC Africa 03. Oh, oh good big knee. knee, big knee, great knee. Oh, oh, oh. can you hear the crowd going crazy? Oh, oh nice bang. right hand, landing a big left right there. Costa is unloading. Oh, Round oh, and pound. Costa! When he fought Wenzel Nell for the lightweight title, he came in and completely dominated. Oh, wow, the elbows come through. Nell's in trouble. Getting a very, very easy first round victory. Oh, it's all over! Costa Ianu! Since winning the title at EFC Africa 08, Ianu has successfully defended his title on three separate occasions, proving why he is the most dominant champion on the continent. Costa Ianu is the most dominant champion in EFC Africa. It's going to take someone really special and a next level athlete to dethrone Costa Ianu. Don, the magic man Madge, Muay Thai superstar, and the most lethal striker on the African continent. This 22 year old was already a global Muay Thai superstar who was ranked second in the world. <laughs> Don Madge has to be the most gifted striker in the EFC Africa lightweight division. At only 22 years of age, Don Madge has already conquered the world of Muay Thai, and now he looks to dominate the MMA world as well. With an impressive victory on his hexagon debut, Madge introduced himself in spectacular fashion. In Don Madge's EFC Africa debut against Wade Roth, he went into the clinch, absolutely dominated, landing devastating blows and getting a TKO victory. In Don Madge's second fight against Leon Maynard, he went up against, at that time, the most feared striker and one of the most experienced campaigners in EFC Africa. It's a fight that a lot of people felt he wasn't ready for, but he went in there and he absolutely dominated for two and a half rounds, not for a single second that he backed down or shy away from the contact. Don Madge is a natural born fighter. This is what he loves to do. Oh, he's geeing up the crowd here. Match landing shots. He's off oh, the elbow. elbow. Another big knee to, to oh, the head. He's finishing him off here. He's got a hold of Hector's neck. Very, very, very bad spot for Hector. Oh, there he is. Don, the magic man. With over 70 professional Muay Thai fights, Don Madge brings a level of experience to the hexagon that is unmatched by anyone on the African continent. Don Madge is proving to be one of the most dangerous lightweights on the African continent. This kid is the future of the lightweight division. EFC Africa 20, Costa Ianu versus Don Madge, 27 June, live from Carnival City. Only on Supersport, your world of champions.